hey guys welcome back long time no see i know i've been gone for a month i'm so sorry i've just been going through a lot lately and this is a video just to update you what's been going on when i'm coming back and all that kind of stuff so thank you guys so much for being patient with me and still subscribing and commenting and watching my videos i really really appreciate it and yeah if you guys want to know where i've been and what's been going on with my life um this is the video so first starting off i want to apologize for not finishing vlogmas i'm really sorry i wanted to finish it it's just so many things happened and i just couldn't edit or even think about like putting out a video for whatever was reason what was going on so on christmas day my grandma was sent to the hospital because my grandpa had noticed that she was acting a little weird she wasn't responsive she was just sitting there and that's not like my grandma so he sent her to the hospital and she's been in the hospital since december 25th and she barely got released which is january 20th she was in the hospital for a month so that's basically where i've been this whole month i just in the hospital staying with my grandma visiting her and you know spending the night there because my grandpa didn't want any didn't want her to stay alone while she was in the hospital so we all rotated and spend the night um so my grandma was never alone but my grandma was very 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 sick the first two weeks um my grandma was seriously like not responsive at all. It was a very difficult time for myself and my family to go through things that she had got. Like they said, people don't live with it. And I'm not going to go into detail what she got or any of that stuff. But she was just very, very sick where she wasn't going to make it. She wasn't breathing on them. She was breathing on the tube. And we had a decision for two weeks to pull the tube out. And um, she wasn't breathing on her own. They would test her and she wasn't doing very good. So... There was a chance that when we took her off of the breathing tube, she would pass away because she wasn't where the level she was supposed to be at. So two weeks came and we had to pull her off of the ventilator. And some, by some miracle of God, my grandma started breathing on her own. She started talking. She was awake. She was alert. She was my grandma. My grandma was back. I don't even know how it's possible for her to be here right now. Like, it was she's a miracle like seriously my grandma is a miracle she she is so blessed for everybody that prayed for her and i think everybody that you know prayed for her every single day she got better my grandma is a very 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 strong woman and this just proves it because she was not supposed to be alive and she fought it and she's alive slowly but surely she's getting better today she made it home um with my grandpa her cat and her dog so i'm pretty sure she's super happy to be home and out of the hospital and i'm just so thankful that i got another chance to have my grandma here and to spend more time with her um but that's basically where i have been i just been with my grandma because of the situation that was going on and i didn't feel like posting i would just come home and cry i didn't want to talk to nobody i didn't want to do anything i just was sad you know um it's very difficult to hear that you are like pretty much gonna lose your grandma and your grandma's not gonna be here anymore and then you think about all the times you spent with her and now that she's better i could do all those things again with her and i'm not gonna take it for granted but yeah i just want to say thank you guys for being so patient and understanding of the situation even though you didn't know what was going on but if you follow me on instagram um you probably saw like some pictures i was posting of me at the hospital every day and stuff like that but i didn't want to post it anywhere else um but this is just me telling you guys where i've been uh it's just been a really tough month like a really really tough month but i'm so glad that my grandma is okay and she's home and yeah sorry i didn't mean to cry but you know just the situation but anyways um yeah that's basically where i've been i want to say thank you guys again for being so patient with me and understanding and i just want to say i love you guys and I'll probably be posting a vlog on the weekend. I'm not sure, but I don't really know when I'm going to um, post um, some like outfit of the day videos. Just I just want to make sure that I know that my grandma's okay. She's my main priority right now. So just be a little bit more patient with me with the videos and they should come out soon. Uh, I just got back from the nutritionist and 
that appointment didn't go so well i'm losing weight but i'm not losing the right weight i'm losing muscle so i'm like stressed out with that trying to figure out why i'm losing muscle so i'm just like a mess right now i'm like so stressed um but anyways i just thought i'd go ahead and let you guys know where i've been but that's pretty much it for this video and again thank you guys so much i love you and i will see you guys next time bye